Russia seeks to procure electronics for drones through Uzbekistan. Russia intends to create and finance shell enterprises in Uzbekistan for the assembly of drones using foreign electronic components. This move is seen as an attempt by Moscow to use Tashkent to circumvent international sanctions imposed due to its large-scale war against Ukraine, reports the Ukrainian National Resistance Center. In particular, this was discussed during a meeting between the leaders of the Commonwealth of Independent States on December the 26th, 2023. Russian President Vladimir Putin and Uzbekistan's President Shavkat Mirziyoyev. Preliminary agreements have been reached regarding the creation of a number of shell companies on the territory of Uzbekistan, which will be financed by the Russian government, the article states. However, according to the National Resistance Center, this involves the creation of fictitious companies to circumvent sanctions and enterprises that will be involved in the assembly of drones using foreign electronic components. The products and components are planned to be exported to several Russian defense enterprises, including Kazan Instrument Plant, Elecon Plant, and Stella K. The National Resistance Center also reported the Kremlin's plans to purchase stocks of Soviet-era ammunition from Uzbekistan. Therefore, Russians plan to continue deploying fictitious enterprises in the countries of Central Asia to bypass international sanctions, the statement said. Besides Uzbekistan, Armenia is one of the countries helping Russia bypass international sanctions.